It's been two weeks since the release of Path of Exile's new League, Settlers of Kalgor, and I grinded the crap out of the League the first week, and it's been a week since I haven't played Settlers of Kalgor, so I just wanted to create this very quick video on the fact that I will be going back to Path of Exile and grinding 3.25. I left off, I just had entered maps. We're going to continue that. My build, which is the Bleed Gladiator build, is coming along nicely. And we've made a lot of improvements. And I'm looking forward to really stepping up that build and making it more survivable. Uh, so I'm looking forward to that. And I'm looking forward to actually completing all the maps. And whether or not we're going to be able to get to the 16s and tier 17s of the maps we'll wait and see what uh, you know i damage is an issue survivability is an issue but that's more about the build and that i need it that uh, i need to advance my build and that costs a lot of currency however through the shipping my last shipment i got a divine orb which is my first divine orb for the season now a lot of you may be chuckling oh my god you know i got hundreds of divines already uh if you know, you may not know, I'm very new to Path of Exile, very limited experience, probably a couple of, maybe a couple of hundred hours in the game. So I'm very new. I have a lot to learn. And that's the premise or one of the premises behind my decision to go back to Path of Exile and play the game. But before I get into explaining what I'm gonna be doing in the next couple of weeks, I wanted to just do a quick reminder that a lot of you continue to watch my content but yet do not subscribe. If you can find it in your heart to hit that subscribe button, I would really appreciate the support of my content. Thank you. Uh, now, let's get into why I'm going into Path of X while I'm going back to Path of Exile. So there are a couple of reasons why I chose to go back to Path of Exile. And primarily, the biggest one and the biggest reason is the fact that Path of Exile 2, for those of you that don't know, is coming out f shortly. The closed beta is just around the corner, and I would imagine the full release of the game is... Uh, actually, we don't know. But it is in the near future, at least we hope, and I want to be prepared for that next step uh, and Path of Exile 2. So I want to equip myself and learn and advance in my knowledge in Path of Exile. Although PoE 2 is going to be uh, different than Path of Exile, the OG game, uh, there are still base core mechanics that are going to translate into Path of Exile 2. At least that's how I understand it. I may be wrong. You guys correct me if I'm wrong. But at the end of the day, this is a game that I am slowly finding and getting more attracted to i'm having a lot of fun playing it i love the depth that's in this game and that the fact that i have people coming in all the time on my streams telling me i have ten thousand hours in poe and i'm still learning that to me is very appealing now in the beginning when i started playing path of exile and 3.21 crucible league was the very first league i played in i was like everyone else, everything you hear, yeah, you're overwhelmed. But I decided to just chug along and take every league that I played in and learn a little bit more. And I've done that. Uh, but I am still uh, leaps and bounds away from being even a mediocre player in Path of Exile. However, it's not stopping uh, my passion for the game and it's not stopping me wanting to learn and elevate my knowledge and experience in the game. This is the primary reason why I want to go back to Path of Exile and play it and grind it. I want to learn it, and I think it'll catapult me into Path of Exile 2 in a much better light. Also, another reason is I'm just having fun. 3.25, look, every league, every season, every cycle has good and bad and 3.25 is no different however i'm enjoying it and i know it's a personal preference some people may not some people do whatever but for me 
I'm really having a good time with the town mechanic. I love all aspects of it. So I want to get back into it. And at the end of the day, when I wasn't playing Path of Exile this last week, I always thought about it. And to me, that's a sign that that's the game I should be playing. So I'm going to be playing Path of Exile. I'm going to grind. Hopefully we get further and further into the maps and hopefully my build gets stronger and stronger and I can complete all the end game content. And lastly, and most importantly, I want to improve my knowledge in the game. And there's a lot of layers into it. I'm not going to learn everything in one league, but I do want to increase my knowledge in the game. And that's why I want to focus on Path of Exile. Anyway, that's my explanation. I would love for you to come by and watch me go through this journey. I will be streaming Path of Exile for the next little bit on Twitch. Channel name is Sammy Caps. Come over. We got a chill, cool community. We'd love to have you. It's a good mix, actually. We got a lot of seasoned veteran POE players, and we got a lot of newbies like myself that are learning the game. And I'm proud to say I've motivated a lot of my community to go and try Path of Exile. And if you're on the fence and you haven't decided to play Path of Exile, I would recommend you give it a try. I think it's a game, yes, you are not going to master it. You're going to get frustrated. There's a lot to learn. Very high learning curve. But I can tell you this. I was in the same boat four leagues ago, five leagues ago. And I'm better off now that I stuck with it and got through it. And I'm learning a little bit every leak. And... I have this to say to you. You can take the best out of every game. And Path of Exile is no different. You don't have to be a master of Path of Exile and all its layers to enjoy the game. Some people will just go and play with the town mechanic. And that'll be enough for them. Some of them love crafting and selling and making currency. Some just love grinding and leveling up different classes and builds, and then they'll level up another one. My point is there's something for everyone in this game. You do not have to be the Jeff Bezos of POE in this game. There's You can take whatever you want out of it. And at the end of the day, the game is free. And every time I say that, someone throws in a comment that it's not free, you have to buy stash tabs. Well, yes, but even getting yourself up with a $30, $40, $50 investment in the stash tabs, which is probably what you'll need to be able to play the game effectively from a stash management perspective, I think that's a low investment for such a game, for a game that has so much depth and layers to it. But that's my opinion. You take it for what it's worth. Anyway, that's what I wanted to share with everybody today. So as I said earlier, come and watch me grind Path of Exile on Twitch. Channel name is Sammy Caps. I'd love to have you. Come over. Say hello. I love talking to everybody. Like I said, we got a cool, chill community. All right, everybody. That'll do it for me. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching. The opinions expressed in this video are mine and solely mine. Healthy debate is always encouraged. Hate is never welcomed. So get over it.